Hello and welcome back. Today we will be talking about how to make a uh, pressure triggered um, contact uh, detonator. So what we will need uh, to construct this explosive device is an explosive device, so explosive with um, a detonating capsule. We will need a 4.5 volt battery um, and we will need the wires, a uh, metal container, a plastic foil or waxed uh, paper, uh, and some metal, uh, thin metal sheets. Uh, this uh, detonator uh, is meant for airplanes and will detonate when at approximately 1000 to 1500 meters in height. Uh, the process of making this device is as follows. Uh, over the container we put the plastic foil so that it covers the top of the container uh, on all sides. The foil should not be tight. Uh, it should have a dip in the middle. Uh, and uh, then we secure the foil hermetically with insulating tape to the uh, container. Uh, no air should be allowed to pass through um, the gap between uh, the container's edge and uh, foil. Uh, then we take uh, two metal pieces of metal uh, sheet. Um, of, uh, approximately 0.5 millimeters uh, in thick uh, and uh, we need to keep in mind this will be um, the actual detonator contacts. Uh, one should go over the container and one should only go to the half uh, but they should be long enough to overlap. Uh, then we slowly place them over the container. Uh, the shorter one is placed underneath. Uh, the longer one that is placed over the container is placed on top. We make sure they do not touch uh, and place them approximately one to two centimeters apart. So that the space between them that they are not touching is one to two centimeters. Then we uh, secure them to the uh, container with insulating tape um, and we make sure that they are both not touching. Then we connect the explosive device uh, and the uh, battery. Um, the uh, working principle of this device is that when the airplane is on a certain height, the air in the uh, container seeks to equalize pressure and pushes out the foil, thus pushing the two metal pieces together, completing the el electric circuit uh, and detonating the explosive device. Uh, if there, the airplane is with controlled uh, pressure within the cabin, this will not work and the device needs to be placed on uh, the out, uh, outer part of the airplane or the, a part of the airplane that the pressure is not regulated. That's all to, for today. Thank you for listening.